Hey friends, it's Julia here of Gosser Family Dairy. And one of the questions we get asked a lot as grass-fed dairy farmers is, how do you feed cow's grass through the winter? So instead of telling you, I figured I would just show you. Good morning. It's about 7 a.m. here. It's February, it's cold, lots of snow on the ground, and I'm getting ready to head out to do morning chores. For those of you who have been following us, you know that we're a certified organic dairy farm that ships our milk to Organic Valley, and our cows are 100% grass-fed. Um, but if you're just joining us, hi, I'm Julia. Being a 100% grass-fed dairy means that we're able to feed our cows a grass-only diet in winter because all summer long we are harvesting hay. Hey! Hey y'all! Hey! Hey hey! Okay, we are on fourth cutting. It's August 22nd and I think Dan and Matt are chopping back there. I wish you could smell this right now. So yummy. I'm actually on my way. Um, to meet up with my brother-in-law Dan and we are going to show you what mornings look like here on the farm. Here Dan is bringing one of the round bales that we wrapped. This will actually go into the mixer too as part of the feed ration. So typically Dan starts mixing around 6.30 in the morning. We get started by getting all of the ingredients together for the recipe. This is fifth cutting here. Um, second cutting. And this is dry head. And then I bought this first cutting. And so we try and get a blend just because of the different energies of the It's kind of different feel as well. And here we have garlic salt for overall cow health and then a mineral. So this is called a facer. The facer basically takes off the first layer. That way they're getting completely fresh feed. And this is actually a sorghum stack, and we're gonna put a little of that in too. Now this is the dry bale. That allows for the digestion to be slowed so that the cows are able to get the most nutrients that they can out of their feed. Starting at mixing. So the reason why we really like to do a variety of feeds for the cows is that they help balance each other out. So some soluble protein is good, but then you can also balance it out with a high sugar, high energy, and help them to absorb all the nutrients that they need. The snow is really coming down. Good morning, girls. We've been milked already this morning. People often wonder, well, do the cows get cold in the winter? And this temperature is actually perfect for the cows. Their four-part digestive system turns them into basically little furnaces. <laughs> so the cooler weather is actually less stressful than sometimes the hottest parts of midsummer. Here comes the mixer wagon. You have some riders. <laughs> Are you getting excited, girlies? <laughs> it always tastes better when someone else has it. We work hard all year long preparing for this season, and here's the end result. Happy cows enjoying grass all winter long. If you liked that, subscribe to see more from this Organic Valley Farm. Yeah.